Hello, this is Doug Smith, family-friendly canine dog training in Northern California, and this is Luna, a six-month-old husky, and we're going to be following her progress as today is her first day working uh, on any one of the obedience commands, but we're going to be working on loose leash training and prong collar introduction today. Hope you're able to follow her progress, and I hope you enjoy. Okay, this is our first of six sessions with Luna, and we're going to walk down to the park so we can get started on her prong collar. Right now, she's just on a flat buckle collar, and you can really see her pulling me and hear her breathing really laboring. This is very common when we first start and for dogs walking on a flat buckle collar. Her family has trouble walking her, but we're going to change all that. Okay, now we're at the park, and Luna is now on her prong collar instead of her flat buckle collar. And what I'm working on here is for her to submit to the leash pressure. And you'll notice that every time the leash gets tight, I let it get tight. And as soon as she comes back to the leash, the, loose, the leash gets loose again. So we're really teaching her what the difference is between a tight leash and the, the leash pressure from the prong collar and, um, and walking nicely on a leash and having the leash nice and loose. So you can see here, um, she takes to it really well, and all of a sudden she is really giving in to the leash itself and, and really following the leash more than anything else and starting to pay more attention to me. Notice here that I'm just going to use real light leash pressure just with my two fingers. There's never any reason to yank and crank on this leash. Just use the pressure from the prong collar and that's all you need. This is a great clip because Luna's decided to sit down and doesn't want to walk with me. So here I'm just holding the leash nice and tight with the prong collar pressure, the two fingers, and you can see I'm doing so until she decides to give in. Every time she gives a little bit, I give too. So this is the last little bit of prong collar conditioning with Luna before we start on the heel. Notice she's following the leash really nice. I'm not yanking on the leash at all and because it's just not necessary. She's following me around and paying attention, looking around, but really just continues to submit to the leash pressure as she feels it, which is the magic of the prong collar. So this is kind of the end of the initial piece. I'll tell you what, you sure deserve a reward, Luna. Great job.